Jada Korea Pinkett Smith and Willard Carroll Smith the second. Who could they possibly be? Well, we're gonna find out today. Well, you probably know them already. You've seen them in movies like Bad Boys, Fresh Prince of Bel Air, also Fresh Prince of Bel Air, Madagascar. But what, wait, why, why do we talk about them, right? Well, it's because they're crazy. One likes to lie about themselves and think that everything's fine, and the other one, she's a. Uh, Supposedly a witch. I don't know. She believes in a, a lot of spiritual a lot of spiritual things that are just odd and Willard He doesn't really tell her no, I guess, but how did they meet? They met in 1994 on the set of Fresh Prince of Bel-Air where she is said that she liked his junk quote-unquote Next year, I guess they started dating for a little bit. Uh, he saw her on something called a different world Smith officially asked his wife for his hand in marriage in November of 1997 saying one day we got engaged and the next day We found out that we're pregnant Smith told I guess a magazine boom They had their first son Jaden. No, well, he had a, I think he has a kid with some other lady before that before they got married or something too but Moving on moving on they got their second child, which was Willow. One big old happy family here now. Beautiful. Wow. Amazing. So, let's move on. Where things got a little spicy. In April of 2013, it was revealed that they were in some sort of open relationship. An open relationship means having more than one romantic or sexual partner at a time. That makes about as much sense as I could read it out. Non-monogamous, meaning polygamous. But it seems like she gets more of the advantageous gain out of all of this. There's a bunch of interviews out here stating a bunch of really, really spicy stuff. Jada Pinkett Smith brought herself to the red table. Will Smith joined her. They talked about pain, healing, and Jada's entanglement with August Alsina. So she had a relationship with some younger man, not minor, but he's younger than Will. It's a situation that I consider private. You just feel like it ain't really nobody, no, nobody's, nobody's business. Nobody's business, yeah, but... Yeah, but now Black Twitter has <laughs> claimed it as their business. And I guess Will was hoping that would stay in the closet or whatever. Hey, you know, whatever, you know, but I, eh. <sighs> bro, come on. You and I were going through a very difficult time. Yeah. And we decided. I was done with your you, ass. Yeah, you kicked me to I the curb. I was done with you. Yeah. <laughs> I was done with your ass, dude. That was like truth. He was, he, he probably still feels that, honestly. You know that hurt even back then, and you know this still hurts right here. Those fake smiles they got going on right here, it's pretty interesting, you know? Basically. Marriages have that, though. Yeah, Marriages have that. Yeah, we basically, mm -hmm. we broke up. And then what did you do, Jada? Well, you know, I think I got into a different kind of entanglement mm -hmm. with August. I got into a different kind of entanglement, so what? She, um, she might have been in another relationship already then, or something was already going on. That's what we're finding out. Something was already going on there. And she gets with in September. I don't get how she could explain. I got into another entanglement, but you guys were separated. So like, whatever, that's, that's on you guys at that point, you know, separated. You can fucking fuck around, I guess, if you want to. An entanglement? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yes. A relationship. Yes, it was a yeah. relationship. Absolutely. Will had to put like, nudge that out of her really odd that that happens she is trying to save face in front of us because you know she doesn't want to look like a fucking jackass which she is and so is he so is he absolutely entanglement no it was a relationship lady it was a fucking relationship will gave august permission to sleep with his wife he did what he gave fucking permission? Who said what? Hell no. Ain't nobody fucking my wife. I'll have you know. You're dead if you do that. <laughs> Stupid. What the fuck? <laughs> She's out. You're dead. Easy clap. Clarity on the misconception that Will gave August permission to sleep with his wife. There's the only no person way. that can give permission in, in, in that particular uh, uh, yeah. circumstance is myself. Yes, exactly. Yeah. Okay, so she, she didn't get permission. I was, whoa. She just said, no, fuck you, Will. I'm gonna go fuck this guy. She did this. And then she did this. But what August was probably trying to communicate, mm -hmm. because I could actually see how he would perceive it as permission because we were separated mm -hmm. amicably. Yeah. And I think he also wanted to make it clear that he's not a homewrecker. Who, who said what? Both of you are homewreckers. I don't understand how you could even say anything so stupid. Like, that's actually just 
Retarded. I don't even get that. <laughs> like, what the fuck? Did she say words right there? Did those words make sense, anybody? Please tell me, please. And look at that look in his eyes. Look at that look. Amicably. Yeah. And... <laughs> what the fuck, yo? Oh, I love this. Why would you even go and talk about this shit? You guys could have, like, not done this. You, like, self-report? Oh my goodness. Oh my fucking goodness. Why August? I just wanted to feel good. It had been so long since I felt good. And it was really a joy to just help heal somebody. Eventually. Oh God, what the fuck did she just say? You just fucking what? You, you're, you healed somebody? Who? You just hurt Will. And you just, you just did it again by saying it right there. How you said it. Holy shit. This lady just got the knife that's already in there. And she started just going in there. Yeah, fucking hey, hey, hey. Holy shit. That woman is crazy. I felt good. And it was really a joy to just help heal somebody. <laughs> it's just joy <laughs> to heal somebody. Oh my God, those are the craziest things ever. And her giant smile, I'm glad she's we so August happy about broke it. things off and they wow. haven't really talked since. And the Smiths claim they are now stronger than ever. We ride together, we, we die, die together. together. Bad, Bad marriage, marriage for life. life. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck did I just see and hear? Apparently, Pinkett invited uh, Smith's ex-wife to the red table also to talk. Thank you for loving my baby. He comes, he says, I want to get her a present. And he wanted to get you a little candle. That was a turning point because I did see your heart with Trey. I did see that you love this kid. I'll be honest with you, I had my doubts. I know you did, because I... Do you remember when you told me it was Trey's birthday party and you had invited me. You looked at me and you said, you know he's not easy, right? Was I talking about Will or Trey? You be talking about Will. <laughs> Was I right? You yeah. were. That's what I'm saying, girl, for just looking out. Just looking out. I guess she got her on the fucking show. They did their uh, little interview and I guess it was cordial. Apparently it was actually very cordial. They were cool. I guess they kind of have a good healthy relationship to that, uh, per se. He wrote a book. He did the slapping. Who, who the fuck slapped who? Will Smith slapped Chris Rock in the face. In what seemed like a desperate attempt to defend his wife's honor, Will Smith jumped on stage and slapped Chris Rock, earning him eternal banishment on the internet, in addition to a 10-year ban from the legendary award show. Many fans pointing the finger at Jada for causing most of the issues between them. For Will to jump to her defense at the Oscars after what many perceived as years of toxicity was baffling. That happened. He still stayed there and got awards after he you know slapped no uh, no assaults charges or nothing so you're allowed to go and slap people if you're famous just remember that and you could be crazy in october of 2023 pickett smith revealed that she and smith had been separated since 2016 and then will says this and this is one of his recent interviews it's funny i like this this is <laughs> this is one of my favorite things right here this happened two years ago though all right they are a power couple Many believe they have an unconventional marriage. I'm I'm on the side that they are a power couple. They have to be. Look at them. They gotta be. Because, you know, if you're letting other dudes fuck your wife. That's gotta be powerful. Because now you came out stronger, better, faster. You came out Kanye West on the end. It's time for me to stop running. I need to believe what people tell me. Let all my fans know I love them. But a gay fish just can't live in the outside world forever. And you know what? That's always better. You came out Kanye West. So how do you handle all the chatter then, Will, about your marriage? I have decided that chatter about my life can be of a benefit to people. I think the chatter is a really- You know what? It is. It's gonna be a benefit to me because, you know, I get to talk about you being a little bit funky. The fresh prince of cuckoldry. Or whatever. Hey, 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 ho, 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 ha, ha, ha. I'm just being a dick here, ain't we all? No, but I just die. It's chatter. Yeah, duh, bro. You, you guys put this in the public. Every, of course, people are going to chatter about it. What the fuck are you talking about? You're on Sunday morning. You could just say, I don't want to talk about this. But you continue to talk about this. So like, it's... it's Chatter is the first stage to uh, having a real conversation and being able to truly explore if some of the things in your heart are loving or 
poison is. You uh, both have talked very candidly. It's a very famous story, infidelity in the marriage and how you navigated that, that there time. Never, there's never been infidelity in our marriage. Never. Say what? Are you gonna tell me? You're gonna, you're just gonna lie like that. You're just gonna say, no, there's never been infidelity like that. Sure. I'm surely gonna believe all of those words that just came out of your fucking pipe hole. Makes no sense. Even she states it. She, she sees it as infidelity and you, you have no... There's really no way that you can say that it's not infidelity. Like maybe at one point where you guys were truly deciding that it wasn't. Yeah, sure. But before that point, it was still infidelity. You do what you do. Ever been infidelity in America? Never. Never. Jada and I talk about everything and we have never surprised one another with anything ever. I'm really, really sure that goes against stuff he said in the past. I'm pretty sure. There's no way that it doesn't. That is just wonderful. Y'all living together? It's just this beautiful connection. Pro we will. Look at that. We Not will. right now. But you will. But yeah. You will. Oh, yeah. That's. Why yeah. do you say that with such a clarity? <laughs> um, because this that's, that's what it's going to be. That's where mm -hmm. it's headed. Yeah. And you, you both know. are on that page. Yeah. And you know, but right now, I really do enjoy my space. Yeah. yeah. You know, I've been living I, you alone. Know, I'm a, I am a. She loves this. Honestly, she does. She's happier now. And you know what? She's happier now. And I'm willing to go as far to say that, hey, yeah, you know what? She's probably better off. She should. She didn't want to be a wife like that. She just wanted to be a whatever. I am a my mother's only child. Yeah. Right? Mm -hmm. And so having this time that I've had to myself has been fantastic. Mm -hmm. you know, just to get to know me, you know, even to have my house exactly how I want. Bro, she's probably like an actual narcissist. I really don't. You're so, like, she's more so selfish, right? It doesn't, she seems like a little bit selfish here. I told her, we were just talking about that. I said, that look of love that I saw when you all walked onto this carpet, my goodness. You know, Jack, because we've survived, yeah, you we know? Yeah, we've survived. And you know, and it's the, that, that's the thing that is, it, difficult that people don't understand about love you think it's all flowers and everything but love gets created by making it together that's all we really know so far what do you think let me know let me know what you fucking think because these motherfuckers are crazy actually just crazy as fuck i gotta get back to work though um so yeah hope you guys uh, enjoyed the video don't forget to just subscribe bitch no just don't forget to like and subscribe i hope you have a wonderful day and deuces